right guys, so we're here at ICAST 2018 checking out all the new fishing kayaks, fishing products coming out next year. So we're here in the Old Town Canoe and Kayaks booth checking out the new Topwater PDL. Now this is kind of their, the new budget entry in their line of PDL pedal drive kayaks. And my good buddy Dude Train here from Dallas, known him for a long time, just ran into him randomly here. He's gonna walk us through this boat, bow to stern, show us the features, show us what you're getting for this kind of budget friendly price tag. Check it out, check it out. So what we have here is Old Town's new Topwater 106 PDL. Budget friendly, and if you order by September 28, you get a free Hummingbird Helix 5 DI, uh, which is a lot, th extra 300 bucks in your pocket. So it comes with, you know, a very cool essential that a lot of people don't have in your, their 10 foot kayaks is a open hatch with a lid that's waterproof. You can put all your dry storage, you know, tackle or even rain gear, food, whatever you want in here and it'll stay dry. All right. I like that a lot of the, the shorter kayaks or the budget friendly kayaks, they just put a tank wall and a little like covering on it. Right, right. But uh, your stuff gets soaking wet, you gotta put it in a dry bag. That's right, that's right. Because nice. uh, you know, 10 footers, it's gonna get thrown around and if the wind picks up, you're gonna get splashed right. no matter what. 100%. So, it's really roomy, dude. It's yeah, like right? deep. Yeah, I'm surprised how much space is in this thing. <laughs> really impressive, man. Yeah, and it's got, you know, comes with the regular PDL drive. Um, it's got a brand new hatch. The, the, it's got a new dry hatch uh, compared to the old uh, Predator PDL. This one stays dry and um, you, won't, you don't have to worry about your wallet or your keys getting wet. And it's, it's not very big, but it's, you know, it works yeah, perfect, wherever you need. Perfect for those little essentials. So mechanically everything, this is the same drive on the Predator series. Right. Same right. drive. Okay. Same drive. Super smooth, man. Super smooth drive. Why don't you show us how the drive pops up? Just like on the Predator series, drive comes up super easy, super simple, and, and relatively quick, which is important if you're coming up shallow, coming up on an obstacle you don't see it till the last minute. Makes it easy to pull this up. Some of these propeller drives are not that easy and it really becomes problematic. It's really nice, there's a nice big hole so you don't have to worry about lining up the props through some like, you know, thread in the needle. Really easy to get this thing up, which uh, has been a frustration of mine with some of the other pedal drive kayaks. Really slick design. New for 2019, all the PDL drives come with a four year warranty. Um, the boats itself come with a lifetime warranty. Nice. So um, for a factory warranty, I mean, you, are, you are protected. So that's a very, very good deal. It comes with two side pouches. You know, put your tackle, your your pliers, your fish grips, whatever you need. Uh, it comes in handy when you're you're tossing baits around and shuffling around, and you just, you don't want it all over your floor. So you know, toss it in there, and you know you won't get hooked. For me, that's like where I just throw everything, like the, the catch-all little pocket. Yeah, 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 yeah. New for this year, it comes with two side rails. Yeah. They're regular size rails, so not like you don't need no adapters or anything like that. They'll fit your ram, your ram gear, your uh, all your stuff you really need to use for your fish finders, phone mounts, whatever you need. The seat is um, made out of a really lightweight material than the the Predator. It's not it's not as uh, heavy duty, but it's it's real well made. Uh, it's well designed because you don't feel the bar in the back, like so that. you don't, you know, you're not uncomfortable, you know, eight, ten hours on the water. There's nothing worse than a board jamming up your rear while you're, yep. yeah, yep. yeah. And, and as this being budget friendly, it does not include the, uh, the bag like the Predator has uh, or the underseat pouch, so you, you can find alternatives for that. And it's got, for you guys rigging, lights and whatever, this one has a nice hatch in the middle of the kayak. So you can run your wires through and all that stuff. There's up under the seat, clean, yep. out of the way. Yep. I like that. Got some storage up under the seat. Yeah. I like this, you got this lip up here so that your, your stuff's not flying out. Yeah, Plano boxes fit in there, perfect. And, um, you know, it's got an industry leading rudder system where, you know, you don't have to worry about the rudder cable snapping or anything like that. It's got a really, really big tank wheel. You can fit your black pack, your crate, anything you want, and even a small cooler. So it's it's huge by small kayak standards. For a 10 foot six boat, yeah, yeah absolutely. Huge. Back to the rudder system though, new for this year, it comes with a steering knob and a locking mechanism where when you're drifting or you're trolling or, or cruising it, you want to stay at one constant a straight line, you can lock it and it'll just stay in that 
direction you need to go. Which is really slick. I've said that for a while now. Like these these pedal drive kayaks, that very I don't know if any of them have a way to really lock that rudder in. And whenever you're trying to like drift a bank and you want to maintain a certain angle, the current and the wind will push your rudder, straighten it out. So being able to lock it real quick, real easy, that's money for any time you're drifting, working a bank or whatever. That's slick, man. Talk about there's no high low position. Uh, there, uh, no, not this one. Uh, there's no high low position, but there's uh, adjustments. So you can go forward, backwards, and forwards. There's a lot of adjustments for it, actually. But now I notice that the seat is pretty high up. Yes. That tells me the hole's got to be pretty stable, yeah? It's very stable. Very stable? Nice. Yeah, very stable. Yeah. So it's a stable platform, 10 foot 6. I notice it's got like some kind of deck padding here where yes. your feet would go. Yes. Keep it quiet, keep it comfortable. Yep. This isn't big enough for my fish, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All of Old Town kayaks come with a locking paddle clip, uh, so you know a big wave hits you, you don't have to worry about losing yeah. your expensive paddle. So I know, I know people. Oh, you're in a pedal kayak. Why do you have to worry about? It? Sometimes it's necessary. You never know. You never know. You know, you get into the shallow spots. Yep. You're gonna need that paddle. You never know. Um, yeah. Um, it also comes with two rod holders in the back, uh, which is kind of essential. You know, people forget about, often forget about it, but you might not need it for a rod, but you might need it for. Uh, a, net. a net or yeah, whatever. For, yeah. Whatever, yep. yeah. Yep. It's got a cup holder molded in right here. Molded in, cup holder. Dude, a cup holder is one of those things where it's like any boat that comes out this day and age that doesn't have a cup holder, I'm just like, nope. Deal breaker. <laughs> Deal breaker. Like, it's the simplest thing. If you can't figure out a place to mold in a cup holder or give me an excess or something, right. I'm out. I'm out. Like, yeah. just. It has a big space on the bottom for your um, transducer mount. And it'll accept some of these bigger transducers, it will, yeah? Yeah, it will accept your Megas, or the HDSs, it will, it will accept all the big transducers. Nice. Side imaging is perfect for it. Nice. So the scupper for this transducer pocket is right up here by the front hatch. You can keep your battery, your wires in here, run it right into there. It's nice and out of the way. That's slick. So this is something that nobody thinks about or talks about. But having a drain plug in the right place makes all the difference in the world. And having it right here on the top, in the center, you can flip the boat over, it'll rest on this nose, all the water's gonna come out. There's no place for the water to pool up behind it. Uh, this is something that, again, no one thinks about, no one talks about, super convenient, and uh, I've had a lot of frustration with a couple of my boats and where they put the drain plug. So maybe the only thing I'm unsure about in this whole boat, I mean, it just looks killer for the price of everything. The handle's offset back here. I know why they did it. The rudder's in the way. I know they didn't want to put it back here so you could still mount a power pole or something like that. But, you know, having one handle here, it's going to be kind of lopsided. You'll have to kind of work through that. But I assume use one hand here, support it with the other hand here. You'll be able to walk it just fine. But one thing to think about. It's recording right now. We're both just like, <laughs> All right, guys, so ton of boat right here, packed into 10 feet, 6 inches, $19.99 price tag, $1,999 MSRP for a quality pedal kayak from Old Town. Uh, if you watched my West Coast series, you saw me get out with John Kenny. I got out in the Old Town Predator. Really impressed with that boat. I'm a real big fan of the PDL drive. I've said for a while, it's one of the most just kind of like rock solid drives out there on the market as far as the propeller drives go. Um, but it, just a ton of boat with a low price tag, small package. And if you, you order one of these by September 28th, yep. by September 28th, they're including a free Hummingbird Helix 5 Fish Finder, $300 value right there. So um, get on it. These are hitting dealers as we speak. Like right now, as we speak. So this boat is out. The Topwater PDL from Old Town. If you're interested in a compact, budget-friendly pedal kayak, I don't think you can go wrong. This is pretty slick. Packed with a ton of features. Go check them out. Dude, thanks, man. Thank you. Thanks for taking the time. No problem, man. Anytime.